The Daily Show is a comedy slash news show, hosted by a retarded hack who thinks his Jerry Lewis impression is the greatest thing ever. It is watched primarily by do-nothing, politically impotent liberals who need to gather talking points for their water cooler conversations with other, equally politically impotent liberals. Take into account how a large percentage of the human race is mentally handicapped, and its popularity is explained. It is not a show for intelligent people. If there are any laughs, they come from the politically incorrect supporting characters that appear, such as the senior black correspondent or the British fellow. But even these fruitcakes usually can't make fun you without it being some tired, simplistic, mainstream observation. Yes, you tree-hugging hippie, I said it. As you prepare to give this video one star and move on to search for clips of Alcor singing Kumbaya and preaching free love, take a moment to wipe the phone from your mouth and gather your bearings. I just said, The Daily Show is mainstream. Aside from being a slow-paced, leftist circle jerk, consisting of taking things politicians say and making fun of them like you're in kindergarten making fun of the teacher, The Daily Show misleads people into believing it's some hippie, anti-establishment program that speaks truth to power, when it's really another gatekeeper of mainstream news. It has taken dissent and frustration with politics, which are now common, and is with them peddling a product for the mass of idiots. Can you seriously say that intelligent people watch The Daily Show after looking at this? John Stewart, that seriously unfunny nitwit, needs to be caged. He needs to be put in a box and locked away in a government vault forever. I'm sure we all saw him being super groovy and righteous when he told those talking heads who host Crossfire that they are nothing but political hacks. He pointed out how they and other political interviewers don't hold politicians' feet to the fire. That's very courageous of John, but it's complete, utter, 100% pure hypocritical bullshit, considering how he had a military dictator who overthrew an elected government on his show. Don't bother with the excuse that it's not his job to be a tough people's champion, but instead, to do comedy. It isn't the job of the talking head in the media to be that either. It's exactly the type of gentle, spineless behavior from the left that allows the right to do whatever it likes. Now to any Daily Show viewer I say this. I'm a kind man, and a giver, so I am going to give you a little bit of advice. Watching The Daily Show as a serious source of news doesn't make you informed, insightful, or the least bit capable of holding your own in discussing politics, except maybe when debating with a ship for brains religious Republican. If you want a program telling the Empire that he has no clothes, and one that is funny, you can try watching this show. Otherwise, go sit your ass back down at the kids' table. Oh, I don't agree with every single thing Bill Maher says, but at least he is funny while he says it. And, at the very least, he is a liberal with a pair of balls, which is far more than we can say about the pissants of Comedy Central. Thanks for watching, have a good day.